Today, I'm going to talk about public restrooms versus private restrooms. One of my biggest fears in life is being in a public restroom and having the door open and me being in a compromising position. When I go to the bathroom in a public restroom, I am positioned in such a way, almost be doing the splits with my leg against the door so that way if somebody opens the door, they'll feel some resistance and they will hopefully stop. I feel like you find out how terrible people are when you go into a public restroom. It smells disgusting and it's just, just like shit, literal and otherwise on the floor and on the seat. And you're just like, who does this? Do you do that in your private bathroom? I would certainly hope not. When you see the toilet and it has like 900 rolls of toilet paper in it and you're like, what was happening in here that you thought you needed that much toilet paper? Have you ever gone to the bathroom in your life? Have you ever needed that much toilet paper? I submit to you that you have never. Some people just don't care. I never will understand people that are in public restrooms like, naked in the bathroom and the, inevitably that door opens and then they're just like fuck naked. Part of me thinks that you deserve what you get. Some people won't go to the bathroom in a public restroom. They will go home. I'm really close to being one of those people. I don't really like the bathroom. I know that's weird to say, but I'm not a, I don't like going to the bathroom. Some people love the bathroom. I feel like some people are in the bathroom forever. What are you doing in there? Taking such a long time. Just get in and get out. It should not be a leisure activity. Something that you have to do and then be done with it and then move on and never talk about it, ever. Some people have no problem just like go into the bathroom. I know we've all been in the bathroom with people who have no problem with being in the bathroom. My dad uh, is a weird bathroom person too um, because he's super comfortable in the bathroom and I'm the opposite. So like sometimes like we'll go to the urinal, which is a horrible word for something, first of all, it's, like right next to me. And he'll like talk, like be like, it's good to have you home, son, and like pat my back. And I'm like, don't touch me. I don't know if I've ever told him that that is gross. Also terrible about public restrooms, uh, bathroom attendants. Do women have bathroom attendants or is that just a man thing? You're like, I can get my own soap. Like, I don't need you to get me soap. Oh, a mint? Now you're gonna give me a mint? No, oh, I have to tip you? Oh God, it's horrible. The worst job in the world for me, bathroom attendant, because I don't like the bathroom and I don't like going to the bathroom. And then I would just be forced to be in the bathroom with a bunch of people going to the bathroom. That would be my hell. Like, where am I going, devil? Oh, I'm gonna be a bathroom attendant? Yeah, that seems about right. People go to the bathroom with a door open? What? Where were you raised? In some sort of like weird commune place? Because that's what I imagine they do in communes. They just like, sure, come on in. Like if I'm in the bathroom and then somebody's like, oh, can I just come and do my hair? Oh, no, 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 no. You can't do that. People just need to respect the sanctity of the bathroom and give people their time and their space. The private bathrooms are terrible too. Don't use a public bathroom. It's so gross. I wish that I could be super comfortable about it, but I'm just not. And maybe I'm the only person that, that feels that way about the bathroom. Maybe other people just love the bathroom. So, in public restrooms versus private restrooms. I'm gonna have to go with private restroom, clearly. Private restroom is where it's at. I want a private restroom with like 10 locks on it. And candles. Lots and lots of candles. I'm Ryan G. Duncan, and that's how it is.